We present a legged mobile manipulation system capable of playing badminton, leveraging all the robot's joints and using only onboard perception. The control policy, trained with model-free reinforcement learning, is directly deployed on our hardware without further fine-tuning. During training, the robot learns to traverse the badminton court and execute swings to hit the shuttlecock. Notably, complex motion phases emerged without explicit reward functions, enabling the robot to engage in extended rallies with human players. Badminton presents significant challenges for legged mobile manipulator robots, requiring precise coordination between the legs and arms. To hit an interception point outside the static arms workspace, the robot must run to that position, swing its arm accurately, and potentially tilt its base to optimize the hit. We train the robot to track timed end effector states in simulation by outputting joint position targets for the entire system. We implement multiple swing targets per episode to prepare the robot for consecutive hits. We employ an asymmetric actor-critic architecture, where the critic additionally has access to privileged information available only in the simulation, such as the number of targets left to accurately estimate the future returns from each state for better learning. In addition to limb coordination, the game demands precise integration of perception and control. To track the shuttlecock, the robot relies solely on onboard sensors, filtering it by color and applying an aerodynamic flight model to predict its trajectory. Due to the limited field of view of the onboard sensors, reliable shuttlecock perception is only available for a brief window during each flight, particularly when the robot's base is stationary. To address this, we incorporate a perception model during training that accounts for sensor noise and camera FOV limits and apply the same Kalman filter to estimate the shuttle's state in both training and deployment. The policy is rewarded for minimizing perception error at the time of the swing, encouraging the robot to balance its base orientation and limb control while improving perception accuracy. We validated the trained policy's success rate to intercept shuttles at various positions in both simulation and hardware through extensive experiments. The robot's gait adapts dynamically based on the distance to the target. For short distances, it maintains prolonged foot contact lifting its feet only to reorient the base for optimal hits. When targeting farther locations, the robot adopts a gait resembling galloping, adjusting foot contacts to assist with the hit. Under time constraints, the robot also adjusts the gait to intercept the shuttle in time, enabling faster movement at the cost of higher foot impact and longer recovery time. These results showcase the potential of advanced legged manipulators in dynamic environments. Stay tuned to see our robot push the boundaries of agility and precision in challenging tasks like badminton.